Hi, my name is Dex and today we'll be looking into how we can actually split our suppliers to two different account codes. So this is very common if you like to split your purchases to purchase related suppliers and uh, expenses related suppliers. So the first thing we need to do is we come to account maintenance here. Alright, so then we scroll down. In your current liability side, we have to make sure that we have created two different account codes. One for trade creditors for your purchase related and one call other creditors for your non-purchase related or expense related suppliers alright so once this is done now we can create our suppliers alright close this screen to do that we need to come to creditor maintenance all we just need to do is click here okay so before we can key in your supplier what we need to do is first change the control account code here to other creditors alright so let's say we want to create a supplier for a company that provides your company insurance, right? So let's say you want to do AIA for heart. Okay. So once you have keyed in all this information, a creditor account code will be created automatically, and then you can key in all the addresses, phone numbers, fax number, contact person, and whatnot. Okay. So once we're done, all we just need to do is we press save here, and then now. Whenever you key in any transactions relating to AIA Bahad, it will automatically hit your other creditor control account instead of your trade creditors. So that's actually how easy it is to manage your suppliers properly in AutoCount. Do let us know if you have any topics you would like us to cover. Thank you.